So the first thing you want to do when you're cooking prawns is make sure they're alive. So I've got a, a wee thing of prawns here. All you need to do is give them a shake. You can see they're all moving around there. So it's a good, you want to make sure always when you're cooking prawns that they're alive. Um, these ones were fresh out the water this morning, so I know that they're, they're as fresh as can be, which is nice. You'll see they'll wiggle around, oh, go everywhere. But yeah, you just want to make sure that they're alive and kicking, just like these ones. So the next thing you want to do is get your pan on the boil. So I've got my pan going here, and it's now boiling like mad. Uh, so you want to fill it three quarter uh, full. So nearly to the top and then the next thing you want to do is pile loads of salt in just cheap table salt's good and um, about this much so it's quite a lot it's quite a lot of salt it, it's not going to make your prawn salty or anything actually what it's going to do it's bizarre but it does just does the opposite it makes them really sweet and um, so the next thing you want to do is just put your prawn straight into the water um, prawns can be done, you know, there's no specific time. These prawns are actually large prawns, so they're quite big. Um, so they'll need, I'd cook these for about, I'm going to see how many go in the pan basically, because you don't want to have too many stuffed in. If you've got loads stuffed in, then you're going to need to cook them for longer. So. So you can see that's them in there, and um, they're all submerged, still quite a bit of room. Um, so I'm going to cook these ones for about four minutes. They're big prawns, so when you've got medium prawns, I probably cook them for about three minutes. So all I'm going to do is pop the lid on and leave that there for four minutes, and I'm going to get a colander ready for when I need to drain them. So that's these prawns cooked. They've been in there for four minutes. Again, they're super large prawns. They're quite big and um, it's not often that you buy ones that big normally ours are mediums that we get and and I would cook them for about three minutes um, and now you've basically got two options you can either eat them straight away right now with some garlic mayo or a nice salad or on some bread and butter anything you want to do or you can cool them down uh, run a cold tap over them because they'll carry on cooking just now um, cool them down and then eat them up later if you want you know and, and if you want to reheat them later all you need to do is throw them in a pan with some butter we do it with some butter whole garlic and thyme toss it around salt and pepper and until they're hot inside and that's delicious and there you go that's how you cook your prawns